morning kids and a bright sunny day this morning and it's so nice to uh, see all of you again. We're going to be finishing off James chapter 2 this morning and then tomorrow we'll roll into the first uh, verse of, of chapter 3. So James t chapter 2 uh, in uh, verse 21 it says, Was not Abraham our father justified by works when he offered Isaac his son on the altar? Do you see that faith was working together with his works, and by works faith was made perfect? And the scripture was fulfilled, which says, Abraham believed God, and it was accounted to him for righteousness. Now, if you weren't here yesterday, go back and watch yesterday's because we talked about faith and works and the, the combination of the two. And it's just kind of picking up on that same thought, is the fact that Abraham, he had faith, but he actually, his works then helped prove his faith. And, uh, and then it finishes off in, uh, in, in verse 26, it says, For as the body without the spirit is dead, so faith without works is dead also. You know, so part of our, our belief system starts with the faith, is faith in, in Jesus and, and faith what he had done for us. But then because of that, there should be some works. Because after all, what did Jesus tell all the disciples? He told them to go. He didn't just say, believe. I mean, he wants them to believe, but his last words were to go. And that's the same thing that, you know, God told Abraham was to go. And throughout the Bible, God told people to go. And so their acts of going are the works. And so the same thing God tells us today, that it's, it's more than just the faith, but it's He's going to give us directions on what to do and how to, to lead a life and, and who to go tell about Jesus. And so we believe in Jesus, we believe in that, we have faith in that, and then our works work together to actually then live that out. And, and so the Bible is full of those examples and James gives that one of Abraham because it's one thing to believe, but then it's a whole nother thing is it's, it's, it's putting that faith and trust on the line to actually do. And so Abraham really had to have faith to actually do the work that he, he was called to do. And so in that verse 24, and we'll finish here, it says, you see that then a man is justified by works and not by faith only. And so it's the combination of the two that we need to continue to live out and we need to continue to uh, talk about uh, and so it's not just that faith, but let's just start to show those works in our community, to our friends, to our family, that Jesus is living in and through us. Let's pray. Dear Lord, we thank you for a, just a beautiful morning that we can be outside, that we can start our day with you. And Lord, we're just so thankful for uh, the protection that you have for us. And as we go about our day, help us not just have faith in you, but uh, have some works that show our faith. Just like Noah, Abraham, Lord, that uh, we would just be all about you and all that we do, and it would just change the way we talk, change the way we act, and it change the way we think. And we love you so much in Jesus' name. And all of God's children said, amen. All right, I'll see you guys tomorrow morning.